Hi everyone, I'm Jen Sheffer, Instructional Technology Specialist and Mobile Learning Coach for Burlington Public Schools in Burlington, Massachusetts. And today I'm going to show you in this tutorial how your students will be using Google Classroom with Google Drive and Google Docs and Notability on their iPads. So I am in a student account and I am in a course called BPS Con. So I'm going to tap on that card in my classroom to launch the class and I'll be able to see what assignments are due and the assignment I'm going to demonstrate is called my summer so I'm going to go ahead and tap on open and I'm going to then tap on the assignment to read it and I'm pushed automatically into Google Docs and I read the assignment it says welcome back to school please draw a picture of something you did over the summer now as teachers something like this might be better to share with students as a PDF but if you share it with them as a doc I'm going to show you um, and you could show your students how that they how they would open this file in Notability so if I tap on the I on the right hand side I get my details here and you'll notice that I do not have the ability to open this file in another app so I'm going to close it and I'm going to tap on the X on the left hand side and then I'm going to be pushed into Docs and I'm going to um, click on the I on that assignment there and you'll notice in the details I still don't have access to opening the file in a different app so what I have to do is I have to click on the triple uh, line menu and I have to go to Google Drive now for this demo I have to quickly switch accounts because I just was pushed right into my teacher account so I'm going to go back into that training account and now I'm, I'm going to be in Google Drive as, as a student. Again, just to show you, if I tap on the I on the file, I do not have the ability to open it. So what I have to do as a student, click on the triple drop down and then click on Google Drive. And now I'm going to be brought into Drive. And now I have my classroom folder, so I'm going to tap on that. And I see all the courses that I'm in. I'm only in one course for now, so I'm going to tap on that BPS Con course and I've been testing this so you'll see there's several my summer files so what I'll do now as a student is if I tap on the I now that I'm in drive in my details menu I do have the ability to open that file in a different app so I'm gonna tap on open and now all of the apps that I have connected will appear and the one I want is notability so if you're at the high school level and you want your students to um, use Notability for math or science, e equations and graphs and formulas, they, they might use this workflow. So I'm going to click on New Note and I'm brought into the file where I can now draw a picture. So um, I went to Lake Winnipesaukee and I did some kayaking. So I'm just going to quickly draw this just for the demo purposes and it was great weather and there's my sun shining and I saw lots of seagulls and there so there's my drawing I'm going to now click on that destination button on the left and I'm going to tap on open in and then open note in and it's going to be working and now I can select drive and then drives gonna open and it's going to ask me if I want to upload that and I'm gonna say yes up upload and now I have that PDF with my drawing that I can turn into my teacher through classroom so I'm gonna tap on the I and I'm going to tap get link and I get the notification it was copied to the clipboard so I'm gonna close this and now I can go into classroom now Chrome has to be restored unfortunately this has been happening um, so I have to restore it and classroom is going to reopen and now what I can do is I can tap on add and I can tap on link I can tap and hold to paste the link and tap on add link and it tells me it's adding link and it's been added if I want to leave a comment I can do that and then I can just tap on turn in and when I turn in this assignment I will lose the ability to edit I can unsubmit the assignment to edit okay turn in 
my assignment has been turned in. So now I'll show you what the teacher will see. I'm going to switch accounts. I'm going to go into my teacher account to see that BPS training has submitted the assignment. So I'm going to tap on my BPS con class and I'll see in the stream that there is one done. So I can tap on that to launch the assignment and I can tap on it and I need to tap on the link that says meet Google Drive. So when I tap on that, Drive will open and I should see my students drawing. I get the notification that I have to switch accounts. You won't have to do this. It'll take you right to the students work like it did here. That, that beautiful drawing. So I can close that and as a teacher I can give my student feedback. Now again you'll notice that I have to restore Chrome. It didn't shut down properly. That's happening like I said on the iPad uh, quite a bit so fortunately it does restore quickly and I'm in my teacher account so I can give the student the feedback. Hopefully they'll work this out. Um, and oftentimes you as the teacher may be grading from from your laptop not from the iPad but I'm doing it from my iPad and that was a hundred and then I can I could add a comment if I wanted to or I could just tap on return and it says that when I return the assignment the student will be able to edit the file and comment so if it wasn't a 100 I said I need you to fix question number two, uh, look at number four, whatever the case may be, the student could then resubmit the assignment after I gave them obviously more detailed feedback than what I just did. If I go back into the BPS student account, you'll be able to see what the students will see uh, with their grade. I can open that, see what I got on the assignment, and I got a 100. So there is a quick demo of how Drive Docs, Classroom, and an app like Notability will work on the iPad. Um, I'm really confident it will get better. Um, so thanks for watching and I will hopefully be producing more of these tutorials as we learn more about this new product.